I think board books are the most delightful entry that kids can have into reading. Um, I wrote my board books. Number one, I love rhythm, and so I put in rhyme text. It's not poetry. It is rhyme text. There is a difference, and I wish I was a poet, but I'm not. But I'm very good at rhymes. And um, I also wanted the um, books to be enjoyable for the parent as much as the child. I had experiences of reading um, something 52 times to one child or three children in one evening. And, and when you're reading it for that 52nd time, there should be something there that the adult is enjoying too. And Rosemary Wells, I think, um, has incredible board books. And she was the person that I learned that from, just reading them as a parent. When I read Max and Ruby, or when my husband read Max and Ruby out loud to our kids when they were little, we found ourselves laughing even though we had read it you know, a dozen times by that time. And also Max and Ruby were very much, they were real characters. They were very much like the three children that we were having to um, juggle on our laps while we were reading those board books. I wrote um, my books in rhyme text um, because um, there is a magical lyricism to the language. Um, it's almost like singing to a baby, like when you have a lullaby. Um, I, even with my horrible voice, my children used to say, sing, you know, sing me a song, sing me a song. And I tried to get that musicality in the board books, as many board book authors do. Um, and I also wanted the board books to work with um, the adult that's reading the book, whether the adult is grandma or grandpa or mom or dad. Because if you have to read a book, 30 times, um, it's much more fun to have a book that you find interesting and amusing. So for example, in Beach Baby, I wrote, Beach Baby, Beach Baby, hold mommy's hand, wade in the water, diapers expand. Um, because when I was on the beach with our kids at Cape Cod, they would have those pampers on and they'd hit the water and it was a foom. Um, so while the child is uh, enjoying the experience of you're reading them, you're holding them on your lap, you have this bundle in you, when they're laughing about the book, I want the parent to be laughing with the child or grandma and grandpa. And also in my board books, um, I think that multi-generational reading is to be admired and promoted. Um, and so um, I have some of the few baby board books that actually have grandma and grandpa um, as characters in the text um, to bring that intergenerational um, reading. Um, because when I was growing up, it was my grandfather that taught me how to read. Um, and I think that um, board books are wonderful because they have rounded edges. They're very practical. The people that designed them were very, very bright and really new kids. And they're drill proof. They have coating on them. And what's even more wonderful if, if your kids start to Crayola all over them and they have crayon marks you just get a little Windex and you wipe it all off and they're as good as new.